channel shout out compilation still in progress. Drop your name and where you are watching from in order to get a shout out from this channel. I actually saw myself in a vision, and it appears to me like a castle in the air. Castle. You see Brother Wilson, I feel the interpretation of that dream is wrong. I mean your interpretation is wrong, you see you have always taught me that faith can move mountains. You also taught me that we can always pray things in the physical and of course I am learning more. But this mountain can only be moved with money. Only resources can bring this to the physical. But Brother Wilson you know money is not the issue here. I don't wish to continue taking from you, even though I seem reluctant to do other jobs apart from the work of God. You see Brother Wilson I am not exactly loving you because of money, I actually love you because of the fervency you have for the things of God. Okay, I have just sent $20,000 to your account, anything you need from me for the actualization of this vision, you can always call me. Thank you so much. Between the both of us, you know that you are not going to marry this girl. You are just collecting her money. Mom, that is not mine to decide. Anyway, you see, God has not led me to her, so it is left for her discern if truly God support our relationship. Wilson. Mom. Is everything all right? Are you sure that you are okay? Yes, I'm fine. You are not taking your drink. Oh, drink. Thank you so much. Paulina. Listen to me well, if a man will replace me in your life, I will rather die with you than for me to release you to a man that will gradually kill you. Dad, he is a worker in God's vineyard, and very soon, things will be fine with him. Worker what? You cannot continue feeding a grown man when he has his hands and legs working, that young boy is irresponsible. He is so irresponsible. As much as he is a worker in God's vineyard, I prefer nobody witness than have anybody witness to my dream. Paulina. I will advise you to discern in your own interests. For a lazy guy or any other kingdom worker, which kingdom worker? Kingdom worker under my foot. I need passionate kingdom worker, that doesn't want any work to make him lazy in the kingdom assignment, can't you discern? Dad excuse me. Paulina, Paulina. I know that everything will be alright. Joe, how far? Hope you know that you are performing tonight. Yes. But guy, why did you dress down? What's the problem? Tell the driver to prepare the car I will soon join you. Okay, it is alright. Where are you? I am outside. Please come home. Mom, I have told you several times that I have a mission to fulfill here. I have no assignment or work to do with you in there. I have told you. Don't you think you can stop at this junction? Mommy, I am on a journey, I have a target, I have a vision, I can't stop until I get to my destination. Joe, no matter how far you go in this path, you will have nothing to gain. Mommy, I also have nothing to lose. If I have nothing to gain then I have nothing to lose. That is a balanced equation, mummy, don't disturb me. There is only one thing I am asking of you. That I should come home. That you should stop wasting your life and the lives of people around you for your own comfort. Joe I want you to. Mum, I have a performance. Joe, you are going to perform on a resentment platform tonight. I want to plead with you, at least listen to me for the last time, just this one time, I want you to stop your performance tonight. And come home first thing tomorrow morning. Mom, no show, no pay, how do I make you proud? Mommy I have something to do, I will call you later. Joe don't end the call please don't end the call. Please, oh Jesus, please help me. Joe lets me tell you something, in every woman, they is a trait of the first woman in them. So you have to keep focus, you have to keep focus. My guy, let me tell you something, the person who makes it in life is termed the successful one, and he is the real son, you understand. Now come down and perform. I can no longer continue with you, Wilson, it's obvious that you don't care about me, you don't send money to me again. Becky, Becky, you are shouting. You see, my mom has cut every roads that lead to her purse and money, I have no idea of where I will get money from any longer. 
So how do you intend to keep this relationship? How do you intend to get something for me? Okay, babe you know what? What do you want from me? What will you have me do? As if you have something to offer, what is the use of me telling you what I want when it's obvious that you don't have a penny? Okay you know what? I think I still have the choir savings with me, so let me just take from it and give you. Then I will look for a possible means to pay it back. Oh babe, you know I love you so much, like you are the best to thing that has ever happened to me. And you mean more to me. Why then do you have to make me pass through all this? You see I wanted to know how far you can go for me, you know. So I hope you now know that I can do anything for you. Yes, yes yes. Okay let me have your account details again. Of course, you have it now, how are you doing as if you don't have it? didn't warn you, he come to warn you privately, that you shall treat softly, but you didn't listen, you didn't listen, he will kill you up in Letadi. In the prison of left your people. You are mad. M. I know you were sent. Who are you? Who are you? M. No problem, we will send you to your ancestors now. Whoever sent you is a bastard. Why not choose a better place for this battle? Okay. You useless coward. Daddy, you are going to meet your ancestors. Hello officer. I am at the first choice bar. There is an attract going on. I need backup. I need backup you gently. Boys let's move. Jesus, what kind of dream is this? Joe, I reject it in Jesus name. I will not weep over my son in Jesus name. Oh God, remember me in your mercy, remember me in your mercy Lord over Joe, let's your mercy speak in Jesus name, I will not weep over my son. Please Joe pick up. New. My creator, I will not weep over my son in the name of Jesus. Father, you gave him to me for a purpose, remember me in mercy oh God. Let's your mercy speak for Joe. Our choir children now listen and sings like an employed worker of Joe, Joe's music boys, or Joe boy music, you see your son, is corrupting and destroying this generation negatively. I think the next thing is to relieve you of your duties in the church, I mean your activities, you will be suspended until you can train your child first. That is my final verdict. Firstly, I lost my husband to the neither world, then I lost my son to the world on the street, I lost my honor in the church as a church leader. And now, Joe, I have lost my job in God's vineyard, so what am I left with? What do I have? Mommy. What do I have? Why are you talking as if I am a bad child? Don't worry, I am rich. Why are you portraying yourself as if you are innocent about this matter, you caused it, is it not you? Have you forgotten? Joe, for how long will you continue to sleep like this? Okay what are we eating tonight? Mum, for how long will I continue to bear my father's responsibility? I think it's your responsibility to know what we are going to eat. My responsibility? Are you not the man of the house? Or when your father died, when he left us behind, what did he leave except you? He left nothing for you, if it is property that you are called to inherit now, you won't mention that you are too young. So if you are not too young to inherit his property, then you are not too young to inherit his responsibility, the working of this family depends on you. Yes, because you are a man and you need to do something, you better get up now and go find something for us to eat. At this time. It seems you don't get it, it is not an assignment, it is a responsibility, which must be done. I am fulfilling my responsibilities now. But that's not enough to make you a desert wind. Of course, that time I wasn't lazy either, you know I was very hard working. And of course I will eventually look for something for us to eat. So I decided to be the next big thing in the right direction, you and your people wanted to cage me, don't you understand? We can now see that you are now a superstar through singing in this our church, you are now pompous, too proud, you now find it difficult to come to rehearsals and programs. 
because people call you up and down for ministration, you have become too proud, in fact you are now very rude. Have you forgotten, if you have forgotten let me remind you, have you forgotten how you lobby, you beg to back up in the choir when you first joined this church. Now you have grown wings, you are too proud, Joe I must tell you, because I am like a father to you, you are too proud, now tell me, what are your reasons? Thank you sir, firstly, I will say all glory to God, the giver of all grace, because everything happening in my life, they are the results of what God is doing, I am not responsible for it. So I can say that they are born out of sincere surrenderedness to his will, I was available, and he picked me and said he wants to use me, God is responsible for the increase. I am not the one sir. All that you have been saying have not answered my question. Why have you not been coming to the choir rehearsal? Thank you sir, you see, I used to come, you can ask the choir leader. If I have to miss rehearsal, then it's because of the ministration I used to go to, it is the ministry assignment, I now realize that God wants me to sing, and I have been receiving different calls when I am available. You see the availability of my presence, they're always born out of sacrifice, I don't want to forget my Jerusalem. You don't want to forget your Jerusalem? Joe it's obvious you can't change, you can't hear, are you deaf? Because people call you around. They post your pictures on the posters everywhere, you sing because of money. It's because of God. It's because of money, it is not because of the love of God. You are not supposed to go anywhere, you are supposed to be singing in our church alone. You are not supposed to be going out to sing, and if you must, and if it is a must, the council of elders must approve of it before you go out. Yes, because they paste your picture on different places, Minstrel Joe, we are happy with your progress but the condition is that you have to minister in this church alone. You may leave. Go. Joe, but they are the things you must endure to avoid them talking against you all the time. Endure, when I have a bright future ahead of me. Only God gives bright future. Mummy, it is a lie. Don't you know that God's future, God's plan for someone can be impeded, if one allows emotions to rule over passion. Okay, in that case, you have been running your own race, backing up the wrong tree, you have been running amiss, my dear please, Joe please, I want you to turn a new leaf please. I wish to, I also wish to, I wish it is possible, but mum I have already broken the hedge, I have messed up. Come, come. <laughs> A man has been attacking me for quite a while now. That must be the man you sacrificed against your poor life. It is five years already and now it's renewal o'clock, and the man is capable of drying up your blood, he will summon all the spirit from the grave. If you don't give him what he wants, I can never give him anything, I can't give him a pint, do you know what the man did to me? The man came to my dream, he comes to choke me. Me, J-Boy. I even responded in real life, and he is still chasing after me, you mean I should give him. But we had an agreement, we had an agreement, and you swore on your life. The only way to stop him is to avoid sleeping for the rest of your life, because when you sleep, he will not allow you to sleep in peace until you rest in peace. Wise one, are you joking? You are saying all this because you know I am wealthy now, are you and the gods playing a prank on me? This has not been the route I go through before. No one chased me in my dream before renewal. Take this incense, go and use it. Stop this wise one. This will help you, this will help you to scare him away. You are too playful, do you mean this thing will work? Take, you mean I should collect it? Take it from me, go and use it. This is getting serious. How do I refund all this money now? Brother Wilson, I am sorry for keeping you waiting, I was really weak after the training, I can't even go to work. That is a nice one, my award-winning female fighter. What is it? How are you feeling now? Come off it, but anyway I am cool and I am fine, okay so back to what brought us here, why are we here? I think I need to get serious with my life, so I want to draft from my vision to chase my ambition. Really are you seriously? Sure. Where is the place of passion? 
It is an instruction. Instruction. Yeah. So you are saying God told you that? You see, I have already applied for a job and I am going for the interview soon. So I will need your help as regards to what I may encounter, you know being a first timer. Ooh, okay. Good evening, Dad. How are you? I am fine. Paulina, somebody brought this for you. What's there? It is yours, not mine. I just hope it benefits the both of us. Okay, so aside spirituality and prayers, there are some assignments you need to do. Like you need to dress decently and corporate from the crown of your head to your toes, you need to be very polite in your manner of approach with people. And lastly, I will help you source and print out materials about the company profiles and everything, so that it can help you with the company you are going to. That's beautiful, thank you very much. I wish you good luck. What have I done to deserve a sack letter? A day absence should not lead to this, what exactly is going on? What? No, not at this time. Oh God. I don't think I need all these that she gave to get this job. Unless the Lord builds a house, the builder labors in vain, Lord I pray this job is mine. This job is mine, I claim it, this job is mine, I prophesy into my life, this job is mine. It's okay brother Wilson, you don't have to wear that look, it's always like that at the first time. Is this the way God does his things? You don't have to say bad things to God because of this. But I don't deserve all of this. You don't deserve it, you deserve the very best. And only God knows when to give the best to everyone, of course you have been a very good and devoted worker in God's vineyard. So he will definitely reward your labor. Well, he has rewarded me. How? I was given the job. Are you serious, so why did you wear that look? I was just emotional because despite all of this, God can still. Despite what? You deserve it, you have been a faithful servant of God. Really? Yes, despite the fact that you are a single man, you till stood out from sexual impurity. Wow. That is quite uncommon. I really can't mention all, but you deserve it. Well, leave that aside, I saw your text message last night, but what triggers the sack letter? One of my co-worker called me that the CEO came to our branch and I was absent, and he was not happy at that. He also added that I have no tangible reason to back up my absence, so that was what triggers it. That is serious, so what is your next move now? Yeah, I have started pressing some buttons, so very soon I hope God will answer my prayers. Amen I believe. So let's get going. Sam, what is the meaning of this? See, I am not going to allow you destroy my career, I am not going to allow that, you did it the first time, I ignored it. You did it the second time, I didn't talk, the third time again, in fact I have lost count, why will our parties be clashing? Why will our shows be clashing? Please don't be annoyed, I beg you, please. It is normal, I have been expecting it, anything that happens, you will always ask me not to be angry, even if it is a little thing, you have gone beyond your boundaries. Get me a new manager. Joe, it's not up to that. That is what I want, I want a new manager, throw out an application to the public, conduct an interview session with them, and pick one of the best, that is what I want. Joe Music, Joe Music, well there's no problem, we are covenant friends. So because we are covenant friends you want to ruin my career. It's not like that. <laughs> what? You are stubborn? I know that you are stubborn. If I use the incense on you, won't be able to come back. <laughs> if I don't succeed in killing you, then I will kill anyone related to you. If you laugh too much, you will see me. When you sleep, it is me that you will see, we are now destiny friends. He is no longer interested in your relationship, I am his fiance. Brother Wilson, what is happening? No no. What have you done? It's high time you come out of your shell. Brother Wilson, how dare you cheat on me? Despite all the things I have been doing to make this relationship a reality. I have never told you I wanted to marry you. Oh my goodness. You saw me and you liked me, why? Because I love the Lord. Brother Wilson, you are a scam, so you mean I have been sponsoring another relationship with my money. 
and your so-called sister is another girlfriend. You can make that a quiz, if you think you have been sponsoring me all this while, but I think I can feed myself now, thank you. Brother Wilson, so you mean you are not longer interested in us? Okay, best summary, I wish you the best of luck, thank you. Brother Wilson, this is not happening. Why do you always like to disappoint? So I will not record today. So you have gone to record for Gadja. No problem, you are the real boss. No problem, later you will be asking me to send some money for you, and you disappoint me. No problem get off my phone. Guy, what is the problem? He has disappointed me again, you know that I am supposed to record today. I have done the rehearsal I have perfected everything, but he disappointed me. But why is he doing like this? You know me you know that I have my plans on ground. There is no problem, I will get someone who can do the work, that's a small thing. How are you? I'm fine, before I forget, I have selected the best applicant for the managing job already. How capable. The person was chosen actually without sentiment. That fine, I trust you. Let's do the normal thing for the person, fill in the form and let's get on with the process. It's fine, should I send the pictures? No, I trust your judgment, you are up to the game. Brother for life, we still roll together, okay take care. All right. Oh my goodness, no no no, it is not true. Dad, despite all I did, despite all I invested in this relationship to make it a reality. I am happy this happened to you, can you see now? I warned you about this boy, he is very irresponsible. He was just eating up your money, have you seen it now? But I loved him. What do you understand about love? I hope this will open your eyes to see a better husband. Can you see now, love? Wilson you did this to my child. Joe Music, your new manager is on the quest of seeing you. Why does she want to see me? Doesn't she know who I am? See presently, everything is not going well with me, I will see her when everything is okay. I can't see her, just make sure you hand over everything in the document, the email address, massages every other stuff make sure you give it to her. Bro, I have done that. So what again? Please let me be. I am going through a lot, that mail make sure it is attended to by you. No problem, I will do that. This life, is all about hustle, if you want to succeed you must be ready to do the unbelievable, I am currently doing my unbelievable, you this spirit you think that you are wise. Whenever I sleep you disturb me, then I will not sleep, I won't sleep, sleep is no more my friend, you think that you are clever, I won't sleep, my eyes are wide open till tomorrow. If you have decided not to let me rest, I will also not allow you to rest in peace, I will not close my eyes, my eyes will be wide open till tomorrow. I guess you are looking for this. And I guess you got access to it, when I was asleep. Of course, because when a man sleeps, his enemy comes to sow tears. Good, I am happy you know that you are my enemy. Why did you sacrifice your enemy? Learn lesson, human exactly teach others lesson, you want me to use my friend for ritual. Is this not the sacrifice you have been doing to keep your head up in the industry? I still have to say you are not updated, yes, don't you know that those that hustle when people are asleep are the real hustler. So you think that my hustle won't pay off eventually, and I won't even surely make it. You are joking. Then I am going to make sure that your head goes down to the grave, the way you turn me into the grave, I will do so to you. Who opened the door? I can no longer sleep again. This is not getting funny. This is crazy. What do I bargain for? What did you give me? I bargain for something else. Look at what you have brought upon me. It is not funny at all. These is a pack of bullshit. Bullshit bro. Bullshit. Do you want to kill me? The pain is far more greater than what I bargained for. This is not our agreement. Shut up your mouth. I should shut up. Yes, I never promised you a long life, I only assure you of a better life and fame on one condition. Which was what? Sequential renewal of covenant. Which I did, didn't I? I did it. Look at my face, 
will you tell me I didn't give you another soul when you ask for renewal of soul? I gave you one which was precious to me and you collected it. When did I start using two freaking soul for renewal tell me? No tell me I want to hear. Tell me. A ball will be in your court by tomorrow exactly 2 p.m. It's either you score and proceed to the tournament or you have mercy and exit the tournament. Look I have something else to do. You cannot have anything to do while I am still here, you dare not, didn't I pay you for all of this? What exactly are you doing? Tell me, what else do you have to do apart from my matter? I have something else to do, you may go. I just hope that the ball that will come is the one I can play, because I am tired of this crazy jokes. I have been calling his number and his number is not going through, his number is not connecting, I need to see my son. Who is here? Is someone here? Who do I call now? Mr. Patrick say he will be going on a very far distance, how can a man of this caliber, be staying alone? Hello hello, is someone here? Who are you? I am your manager, I mean I am your new manager, sir, I am sorry you startled me. I actually thought to come share some words with you, sir. Hello, yes I am Miss Paulina, yes okay let's meet at the Genesis supermarket, near the old garage, yes, okay wait for me I will be there in a jiffy, alright. Good afternoon, Mr. Joe Wright. Can I trust you? Yes of course. But you can check it to avoid future disagreement. Everything cleared. All formatted sir. I hope it is not these kind of system, that EOU will be attacked after purchase. Not at all, everything has been formatted sir, can I call the account number now sir? Yes. 22314. Jesus. You have to leave now or I will gun you down and take the system, or I kill you and take the system. Now leave. Joe are you still? thinking about that labby. Yes, yes she will continue to be in my heart, you know how we collected her system, that was the beginning of my success. I just wish I can see her one day and repay her, her presence in my heart keeps me going. I am very sure I will see her one day, and I don't want to disappoint her when I see her. I don't even know her I wish to know her. I always long to see you sir. Anytime I come around, I was always told that you are very busy. That is why I decided to come here myself. Secondly sir, I want to quit this job. When I realize the kind of lifestyle you live in here. But who am I to condemn you? When Christ still wishes to liberate you, you might be a victim of circumstances but you can still fall back to the right path. Get up and go now. But sir. Go and never return, never return. Ah, ah, no, 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 ah, ah. Don't you think you are gradually going crazy? You caused it, leave me alone. How can I leave you alone when all of me is in you? Then remove anything you have inside of me, remove it. Exactly what I am about to do, but I can't, because it will mean that all of you are no longer existing. And why is that? Why? Because we are bound together by a convenant. You used my glory and destiny for fames, we have become one in spirit. Take your glory, take your destiny, I don't need it. I don't need your fame and I don't need your destiny, I don't need anything. Who is shouting? I thought, I told you not to come back here again. I actually came in to apologize for my attitude the last time, and when I entered I noticed that you need help, that was why I came in. You came in as the blood I needed, I allowed you to go scot-free, you still have the guts to come back again. It means you are the one I need to process into the tournament. Tournament? What tournament? You speak in parables. There is no time to waste. Open this door, please don't let me die here. No I don't mean to harm you. I was only trying to defend myself. Please help me, please help me, the game is almost over, I need to score in this tournament before it elapses my extra time, please there is only one way I can be free from this dangerous boat, please. Time, you mean you need time to be renewed, no you can change the boat. I can't, you don't understand, you see, if I jump out I will be swallowed by the river, 
I only need a blood of a scapegoat, so that I can win the tournament. Help me, help me. No you can't, the boat of Jesus is right by your side, you have to jump into it, it's only the blood of Jesus that work for redemption. No I can't, it is an agreement that I pay with my life myself, which I have been doing, I have been doing this for a very long time, I killed my manager, my former manager it was part of the deal. You mean you killed Mr. Sam? Hello I am looking for my son Joe. He is in there. I have ran from God's work to work for the devil full time, he is now chasing after me, I now see them any time. Let me go and look for the keys. Okay. Joe, Joe. Don't leave me alone in this battle. Don't leave me. Death is in front of me, I don't want to die. That is why you need the presence of the greatest warrior, he is specialist in winning battles. Mum, please lead me to him again, I want to walk in faith again. Help me, please lead me to him, I am ready. Say Lord Jesus I am sorry for all my wrongdoing, I am very sorry for my evil ways, I am back like a prodigal son. Lord Jesus I am sorry for my evil ways, I am back like a prodigal son. Please forgive me my sins. Please forgive me my sin. Lord have mercy. I am very sorry Lord, take me as your son again, help me. He is coming closer, if he touches me I will die. I can't find the key, call Jesus, Joe. He touched me, I am going to die. Jesus, Jesus. Joe, are you okay? Jesus help him, oh God help him. Yes, how can I help you? Hello good afternoon madam, are you Miss Becky? Yes, hope there is no problem. Good, your account was used by one Mr. Wilson to save some amount of money stolen from the company. Yes, hope there is no problem. Or am I the one stealing the money? Hello miss, I will advise you to remain quiet, because anything you say or do will be used against you in the court of law, so move it. Officer, I know nothing about the $800,000 you are talking about, I am innocent. I will advise you to keep silent, because anything you say or do will be used against you in the court of law, you are under arrest. You, what are you doing here? Answer me, what are you doing here? What do you want? What are you looking for in my house? I asked you what do you want? You people pushed my son to the street. You rejected him when he was shining and walked him out of the church, so what do you want? What else do you want? Please take it easy. Take what easy? If you repeat this statement again and you don't leave this place, then you will see trouble. You are supposed to be mentors to mentor him to the kingdom of greatness, but what did you do? You pushed him out naked not minding he is still young in faith. He took you people as fathers but what did you do? How did you treat my son? You treated him like a stranger, and you are here telling me to take it easy. Please, we regret our actions. Actually we did not know that what we were doing was wrong, we now know. You now know when my son is late, you now know when my son is dead, right? Oh God, God will judge you all, God will judge you, can you imagine, now they know. I heard he was even preached to before he gave up. My son, my son fought with the demon using the name of Jesus, but... Jesus preferred to take him, when he gave his life to him, he didn't want to risk it again? Yes come in, Ma we have to go now. Doctor, Matthew. Favor. Do you know each other? It was a very difficult time for me, things was so hard, there were so many responsibility on me, coupled with the fact that my mom, was seriously sick, and there was no one to help around here. I ran here and there without any help, it was so bad, I was so helpless, not until I met one man named Mr. Jude, Mr. Jude promised to help me under one condition, that I should marry him. The pressure was too much on me, I did not give in initially, but it got to a time I could not withstand the pressure again, and my mum was dying, so I give in. He slept with me, I became pregnant, and I gave him the news of my pregnancy, he was so happy, but along the line I lost my mother, and I was left alone. Mr. Jude was taking care of me in the pregnancy till I gave birth to you at Dr. Matthew's hospital, I mean when he was practicing then, he was the doctor on duty when I gave birth to you.
When your dad was coming to check on us at the hospital, he was involved in a serious car accident, that very day when I give birth to you and he died, it was as if my whole world crumbled again right before my eyes. I did not know what to do, I couldn't cope with the baby, I could not survive, I could not move on with the baby, I was thinking of what to do, so I went to Dr. Matthew's office to confide in him. And I told him that Predventure he see anyone who wants to buy a baby, maybe I can give the person my baby, and I can use the money to start my life again. He said I should not worry, that he would help me, so I left you with him at the hospital and I went away. It was when I heard her plan against you that I decided to take care of you together with my children, your senior ones, my wife and children were based in the US, and by the next month they will be coming back. I lost his contact thereafter, so there was no way I could trace him or get in contact with him, and there was a time I went back to the hospital, I was told you no longer work there. It is true, I am no longer a practicing doctor, I am now a businessman. No wonder. And at this point, Paulina will decide on what she wants for her life, my dear, this is your mother. Paulina, I am so ashamed of myself right now, I am sincerely sorry, I am sorry. I am sorry. It's okay ma. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell in order to be notified when another video is being posted.